Um, thanks, Kel. Thanks, Bridget. And can I thank you both for championing women's sport and to, uh, to Mark Laduccio, the president of Carlton, thank you for the invitation to be down here today. The $15 million uh, contribution from the Commonwealth Government will join with the uh, Victorian State Government in revitalising this iconic uh, sporting venue in Victoria. Uh, women's football is going from strength to strength. To think that less than a decade ago there were just over 50 female AFL teams, uh, teams playing uh, AFL around the state and now there are more than a thousand teams and across the country more than 2,000 teams. Uh, this facility will enable cutting-edge uh, research, medical research to be done uh, into women-related injuries, uh, first-class coaching facilities uh, for more women coaches uh, in, uh, in football and in sport more generally, and of course a first-class training facility. And it was here at Icon Park that Carlton and Collingwood played that great game to kick off the, uh, the season a couple of years ago and there was a lockout. Over 24,000 people uh, came into the ground and many more wanted to, but there just wasn't the facility. So turning Icon Park into the preeminent footballing venue for women's football here in Victoria is a great thing for the state of Victoria and it's a great thing for women's football.